City and the Daily Dose. The Industrial Revolution in America. Beginning in the later half of the 18th century, before ballooning in scope after the American Civil War, the Industrial Revolution in the United States witnessed a shift in production and scale of goods from handcrafted home-based businesses to machine-aided assembly line production in factories, which transformed the daily lives of Americans more than any other singular event in American history. Known as the father of the American Industrial Revolution, or Slater the traitor to the British, in 1790, Samuel Slater brought British textile technology to the United States, helping to found the first U.S. cotton mill in Beverly, Massachusetts, followed by Pawtucket, Rhode Island, leading to a concentrated rise in industrial development in the American Northeast, which in turn sparked the development of transportation systems to facilitate the precipitous rise in commerce and trade. Other advances combined with Slater's copycat technology before the divisions of the Civil War included Robert Fulton's steamboat service on the Hudson River, Samuel Morris's invention of the telegraph, and Elias Howe's invention of the sewing machine. Following the completion of the Transcontinental Railroad in 1869, industrialization spread across the American landscape moving people, raw materials, and finished products throughout the nation's growing interior, including the arrival of some 14 million European immigrants from 1860 to 1900. The 100-year Industrial Revolution also witnessed the rise of Gilded Age industrialists such as steel magnate Andrew Carnegie, oil tycoon John D. Rockefeller, financier J.P. Morgan, and automaker Henry Ford, collectively earning the derogatory moniker robber barons after they reaped obscene profits on the backs of unskilled, low-wage laborers who toiled in their factories, foundries, and mills. Inventors such as Alexander Graham Bell and Thomas Edison further accelerated the Industrial Revolution through the creation of new technologies that improved communication, transportation, and industrial production techniques such as the advent of interchangeable parts. The period also witnessed a massive shift in worker demographics as millions moved into fast-rising city slums that were unsanitary and dangerous at best. Factory working conditions were frequently filthy and hazardous for both children and adults alike, where low wages and long hours eventually led to the progressive movement in the early 20th century, ushering in labor unions and an increase in federal and state regulations, making the Industrial Revolution in America both a high and low water mark in American history. And there you have it, the Industrial Revolution in America, today on The Daily Dose. If you want early access to Daily Dose documentaries before they're made publicly available, Consider supporting us on Patreon so that you too could feed the filmmakers who feed your brain.